And that breaking news, a gun fired inside the Waukesha County Juvenile Center. Authorities are investigating exactly how this happened. The Sheriff's Office has just released new information a few moments ago in a news conference. Jermont Terry live at the Waukesha County Juvenile Center with the very latest. Jermont. Carol, I can tell you that the 34-year-old man from Heartland is recovering at Frederick Hospital after getting shot in his leg. Exactly how it happened, according to the sheriff here in Waukesha, that individual, the 34-year-old, got into some type of struggle with a deputy, and in the process, the officer's gun was discharged. At two shots went off. The sheriff cannot say at this point if the officer fired his gun, but they do know that this, in, this took place in a conference room in the juvenile center. The preliminary investigation shows that the male subject had attempted to disarm the deputy. It was during that struggle that a deputy's gun was discharged and it, the male subject was shot in the leg. Deputies at the juvenile center immediately responded and provided medical assistance to the suspect who was subsequently transported to Freighter Hospital. Now, the deputy involved is a 44-year-old, 16-year veteran here at the Waukesha County Sheriff's Department. Of course, some very tense moments, but they should point out that this did not take place inside a courtroom. The deputy actually followed this individual inside this room because he saw something peculiar or odd about him. And when he confronted him and or talked to him in that conference room, that 34-year-old from Heartland became enraged and ultimately started a struggle with the officer. Two shots were discharged from the officer's weapon, and that individual was at least shot in the leg once. He's recovering at the hospital. The Waukesha County, excuse me, the Waukesha City Police is currently reviewing this case, which is standard procedure any, anytime there's an officer involved shooting. For now, reporting live with breaking news in Waukesha, Jermont Terry, today's CMJ4. Okay, Jermont, thank you for that update. Now,